But that jamboree happening right now, you see it there on your screen, in that place is particularly chilling because in 1939, more than 20,000 supporters of a different fascist leader, Adolf Hitler, packed the garden for a so-called pro-America rally, a rally where speakers voiced anti-Semitic rhetoric from a stage draped with Nazi banners. When a Jewish protester rushed the stage, the Associated Press reported, quote, instantly, a dozen or more stormtroopers set upon him, knocking him down and beating him as he held his head in his arms. Most of his clothing was torn from his body. Later, he was booked for disorderly conduct. Now, against that backdrop of history, Donald Trump, the man who has threatened to use the military against opponents he calls enemies from within, who has threatened to use, use the troops to quell what he says are lawless cities, and to use those troops to carry out mass deportations of immigrants, 